It's almost impossible to think about penguin movement without shuffling your body from side to side in an almost comedic waddle. The reason for this waddle is rooted in the fact that penguins have very short legs and very large feet. These proportions help penguins swim extremely well, but the trade-off comes when they're back on land. Waddling back and forth can look a little bit awkward, but it's actually a very effective form of energy conservation. Waddling helps raise the penguin's center of mass, which means their muscles have to expend less energy to move. Studies into the penguin waddle and the mechanics of walking are allowing scientists to help people who have increased lateral movement when they walk, such as pregnant people. This better understanding of gait could lead to improved mobility treatments. So there you have it, why do penguins waddle? And if you enjoyed that content, please waddle over to our other surprising science videos. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more surprising science content from the Natural History Museum.